Hi, I'm Jerry Sanders. I'm a senior sales engineer for Dellcam, and I'd like to show you some of the hot new features in PowerMill 2010. One of the new features is actually what we call steep and shallow finishing. And the cool thing about this is it basically generates a toolpath that will cover both the steep and shallow regions with inside uh, a part. We also have the ability to control the toolpath strategy with inside the shallow region. So if we select the 3D offset version, we now have a new smoothing option, generate a nice smooth transition as we move around the part. Instead of actually doing a 3D offset in this shallow region, we can actually raster back and forth, which actually is good for a shallow region. And we've actually applied a little half millimeter clearance away from this steeper wall so the tool won't be banging into the wall and breaking off. This, this tool path here is great for parts because you need to use the appropriate strategy for a part that has steep and shallow regions with inside here. Another new feature with inside um, PowerMill 2010 is the ability to actually rough and finish corners out. Um, it's actually a finishing routine, but if we've used a larger tool, we actually need to remove the material out um, in gradual steps. You can see we have a considerable amount of material in here. So if we just did, used a regular corner finishing routine, we'd actually end up breaking off tools. You can see here now PowerMill will actually take multiple steps, not only down in Z, but also over in XY to remove that material. So this is going to minimize tool breakage and be a much more efficient toolpath than before. So those are just a couple of new features with inside of uh, PowerMill 2010. If you want to find out a little bit more, you can check us out at www.dellcam.com.